but anyways, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and start Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception for today. Uh, we'll see how far we get. I don't think I'll be able to finish in one run, but who knows, we'll see. All men dream, but not equally. I still have the Uncharted uh, Those who dream edition by of night this behind me. In the dusty recesses of their minds, wake in the day to find that it was vanity. But the dreamers of the day are dangerous men. For they may act their dream with open eyes to make it possible. This I did. Actually, I remember this scene too. Strictly no credit, do not ask. Hands up. Enjoying yourself, pal? Oh yeah, you're a comedian. Nice warm welcome. They're both clean. My apologies. One can't be too careful. I'm guessing you're Talbot. Mr. Sullivan. And Mr. Drake. That's right. Do you have it? Let's uh, see the money first. Cut out. Doing a deal. Kind it's of deal, there. though. Now let's see it. I'll need to authenticate it. Of course. What? He's selling the ring? Silver, 16th century, Elizabethan design, inscribed with Sir Francis Drake's motto. Well, it appears to be genuine. Well, of course it's genuine. If I may ask, how did you two come into this? Does it matter? <laughs> My client will be very pleased. Hold on a minute. Sully, this is fake. I assure you, Mr. Drake. Oh, oh, you are right. This is phony as a $3 bill. What the hell are you trying to pull here? Perhaps I should be asking you. This is bullshit. Deal's off, pal. And you? You can tell your client. You blew it. Come on, Nate, let's get the hell out of here. You're not really in a position to negotiate. Now give me the ring, take the case, and walk out of here like gentlemen. While you still can. Do as the man says, son. You're a thief. <clears throat> well, now, that's ironic. Off to a good start. Apparently, this, uh, this bar can be seen. In Uncharted, or not Uncharted, in uh, The Last of Us, you when you're running around a few times. No time to rest. Stand. It's literally slaps. Nice. Come on, let's get out of here. What is this? 
Oh, big boy. Hey there, big fella. I got him. Quick, hit him. Now, bad idea, Granddad. Damn it. Get him. Man, you spill more drink. Another round. The nearby enemies by pressing circle while holding you in the direction. There's a private party, or can I join in? Be my guest. <laughs> Take him down. You go. Oh, yeah. oh, first hit. That was so flawless until then. Please. Get him. Ah, man, this got out of hand in a hurry. Where's the big guy? Thanks. Oh, there he is. Man, that is nasty. Come on. That is. Just give me a second there, mate. I'll be right with you. <laughs> Every time there's a fight like this, it also makes me think of, uh, Splinter Cell Conviction because you have the one scene in the uh, the bathroom and he starts smashing the dude on top of the uh, like the sink and it completely breaks it kind of similar situation Such a great Let's go, scene. Nate. Here, and get out the back. Stop him! I've got the old geezer. How's that boy? Ready to go, kid? Yeah. Oh, whoops. Oops. Oh, crap. Oh. Uh. Typical bloody yank. All talk. Hey, 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 hey. He's had enough, haven't you, mate? Don't. Stay He's down. Hello, Victor. Kate? Still wallowing in the gutter with your protege, I see. Not very dignified for a man of your age. Should have known you'd be behind this. Oh, careful now. Wouldn't want you to melt. <laughs> Same cocky little shit. So fearless. I wonder what you're really afraid of. Not bullets, or blood, or broken bones. No. You get off on all this, don't you? Cheating death. Or not. No. <laughs> Mr. Sullivan, I won't harm your precious boy. I merely want what's mine. Give me that back. <laughs> Oh. oh no. Oh. Shut, Shut up. up. You fool. 
Oh, you're bloody welcome, Your Majesty. Marlow, we have to get you out of here. Ah, oh, come on. They're a right pair of arseholes. What? Cartagena, Colombia. Twelve years earlier. I think it's, this is the the first game where they start like introducing like young Drake uh, scenes. The ones in uh, four are pretty good too. They're still working, supposedly, on a uh, Uncharted movie with Tom Holland. All right. As I, uh, here we go. <laughs> Nathan Drake, younger Nathan Drake. Oh, they changed the uh, the icon for the treasure a lot. Not it either. Oh, nope. I think we have to go to the upstairs. second floor. <sighs> really want us to read it. I'll push right. Yeah, it's definitely up here. It's gotta be in one of these cases. El museo cierra en 15 minutos. There it is. Sullivan. <laughs> Way younger, Sully. Looks so sketchy. Ah, te agarré, ratita callejera. Suélteme. Clase de gente no es bienvenida aquí. Got him. Quédate afuera. Honestly, though, what? <laughs> Why did they kick him out? Because he didn't even do anything. Oh, well, there he is. Gotta keep up with him. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Ah, there he is. <laughs> I said that. No me va a dar tanto. 
Nobody's gonna question the kid crouching. Oh. Don't mind if I do. It was rotten anyway. The lighting is so bright. Eesh. Where is he going? Saying, okay, yeah, that looks promising. To the left here. Come on. Oh, uh, drop down. Word on the street is uh, I need to get a better look. 2K is going to try to sell the next 2K uh, basketball game, 2K21, at $70 rather than uh, $69.99, which I think is insane. 2K is on a le another level crazy. That's a ticket. Adios, amigo. Okay, I gotta get that wallet. Crap, I can't go down that way. $70 games just gives me another reason to wait a few months until it goes on sale. to uh, drop down it looks like he wants to jump to the other side maybe I am supposed to drop down no oh maybe just jump <laughs> climb up and then jump yeah that makes more sense And Kate. Nice. Don't want to lose her. 
the lighting is very strong in this game. Damn it. Don't want to go down there. Empanada. 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 I could go for an empanada. I gotta find a way to get that wallet. Okay, it's right there in his pocket. Now's my chance. Let's see if we have some time to kill. Let's try that again. Let go of me. Ah, that's what I thought. Now don't try to run. You're a long way from home, son. Don't call me that. Parents must be worried about you. <laughs> yeah, not likely. Okay, sore subject. That was a nice lift back there. You're pretty good. I don't know what you're talking about, old man. Hey, don't call me that. Your technique is really sloppy, though. You're telegraphing all your moves. You're crazy. Yeah? You've been tailing me all over town. Probably figured me for an easy mark. But you picked the wrong guy, pal. Uh, uh. What? My wallet. Fine. Maybe we'll just call the police. Go ahead. Of course, they might wonder why a middle-aged tourist is following young boys down alleyways. <laughs> you are a crafty little beggar, aren't you? I know how to take care of myself. Anyway, I'm pretty sure you don't like the cops any more than I do. Good point. Kid. The wallet. Had to try. Of course you did. Telegraphing all my moves, huh? Hmm. <laughs> so you still got the key. And of course they left the window right. open. How convenient. <laughs> Three second story work. These chapters go pretty fast too. What is he doing? Ah, oh, that was close. <laughs> I was gonna say that that was taking a while. Okay. Don't mind if I do. Look who it is. 
The filthy little stray that made off with your wallet. Come on, son. You haven't got a chance. Just hand it over. Now, the ring. What ring? <laughs> Catherine! Who do you think you are, boy? You're nothing but a filthy, cast-off little beggar. You're not fit to touch these objects. What the hell do you think you're doing? He's just a kid. Stop him! <laughs> could have been like my ancestry would say otherwise. Stop the boy! <laughs> Holy crap. Oh. Gotcha. Nope, wrong way. <laughs> Holy crap. He has the ring. Ah. Break the door down. Oh god. He's heading for the roof. Catch him. Go 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 go. go, go. Hurry. Let's go. Ugh. Who the hell are these guys? Nice. Set. Sky. Bad. How you doing, man? Look what we have here. <laughs> Whoops. Being chased by a bunch of guys from right. Matrix. What are you shaking for? <laughs> Just close your eyes. This won't hurt a bit. Got him. Lurking in Z's. Alright, sounds good, man. Yeah, it's late for you. <laughs> You're okay, kid. You can relax, kid. We're safe here. Go on. Suit yourself. You don't want it.
What do you want from me? Hmm. A little gratitude would be nice. I did just save your ass back there. Thanks. But what's in it for you? I mean, you're a crook, right? <laughs> you gotta have an angle. <laughs> you are one piece of work, kid. What's your story, anyway? Look, mister, no offense, but I don't even know you. Easily remedied. Victor Sullivan. This would be the part where you introduce yourself. Okay. Suppose you tell me what's so special about that ring. It belongs in my family. I'm just taking it back. Passed down from Francis Drake himself. That's right. I don't know how to break this to you, kid, but Drake didn't have any heirs. No children. So well, you thought. Not with his wife back in England, anyway. <laughs> okay, good point. Let me see it. Come on, kid. If I was going to take it from you, I would have done it by now. Thank you. So, what is this? Parvis Mem Sick Parvis Magna. It means greatness from small beginnings. That was his motto. Yeah? You see, uh. Queen Elizabeth gave it to him in 1581 when he got back to England after circumnavigating the globe. That's when she made him a knight. Well, you sure as hell didn't learn that on the streets. How's a kid your age know Latin? The nuns sort of insisted on it. Ah, uh, so like a boarding school. That's a nice word for it. Okay, then. So what was all that business with the ring and that astrolabe thing back there? Why don't you tell me? You're the one working for him. Look, kid, a client wants something, I obtain it for a price. I don't ask any questions. It's just a job. Look pretty friendly to me. Yeah, uh, well, anyway, I'm pretty sure I'm fired. OK, look, first of all, that was no astrolabe. It's some sort of decoding device. Check this out. On his way around the world, Drake sailed through the East Indies. Only he says that it took him six months to get from here to here. Yeah, so? So it doesn't add up. He was way too good a sailor for that. It would have taken him a month. Tops. He was hiding something. Something big. How big? Like secret mission from the Queen Big. Like millions in plunder treasure that hasn't ever been recovered. Big. That big? That big. And that decoder has something to do with it. I would bet my life on it. Oh, swell. And Marlowe's got it. Won't do her much good without the key. So it's a stalemate, then? For now. <laughs> so you still haven't told me what your name is? And you still haven't told me what you want from me. OK. Look, you got talent, but you got a lot to learn. You stick with me, and I'll teach you a few things. Thanks. But I'm doing just fine on my own. Yeah, clearly. What do you say we uh, try this again? My friends call me Sully. Nathan Drake. Nate. Drake, huh? <laughs> OK. I see great things in our future, kid. <laughs> great things. <laughs> um, they're gone. I thought it was all right, lads. Okay. <laughs> oh. I thought he was in on it. Perhaps you were going to put a silencer on that thing. Wasn't sure. Sally, you've got no sense of drama. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. 
All that racket's gonna bring the cops any minute. Let's get the hell out of here. <sighs> Could have pulled a couple of those punches, Charlie. What do you mean? I hardly touched you. You headbutted me. All right, all right. I got a little swept up in the moment. Uh, you were the one who said make it look realistic. This is the game that got me really, in, really into uh, Uncharted. Don't lose them. Wrong. Told you they'd take the bait. How long do you reckon before they realize this is a fake? Who cares? Finally flushed them out. Now we just follow them back to their hole. You do realize you make everything sound dirty. You do? Yeah. Let's get moving. Hurry it up, All right, Here we go. Oh, shit. The filth. This way. Run to ground. What? Come on. Really? Come on, Charlie. What's the holdup? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, all right. Well, it'll all be over soon. It'll all be over soon. <laughs> it'll all be over soon. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh, well, that wasn't too bad. What the hell is wrong with you? Nothing. I'm fine. <laughs> Blocked. Wait, we can get around this way. Yeah, yeah, right. Or we could just use a little muscle. <laughs> uh, there's a thought. Yeah, right. The wall's too high. Yeah, I got it. Move this thing over there. Put your back into it, mate. We haven't got all bloody night. What? Yeah. We could help. Thanks for the help. Come on, move your lazy asses. All right. Looks like the coast is clear. You should be more careful with your head, you know it. <laughs> hey, lads. All right, darling. <sighs> Looks like hell spit you two back out. Ah, uh, it was a thing of beauty, Chloe. I went off without a hitch. You're unusually quiet. What's up your bum? Oh, well, Charlie seemed to enjoy himself a little bit too much for there my taste. Go. <laughs> My ears are still ringing. Oh, for God's sake. Helps if you have something in between. <laughs> well, it looks like I missed out on some fun. Yeah, you did, actually. It was very, very uh, cathartic. Yeah, it's funny. Do you have any trouble? Nah, <sighs> easy peasy. And you're sure they didn't see you trailing them? Not a chance. So, which door scary pop inside him behind? Behind that one there. The green one. They drove in ages ago, and it's been dark ever since. You think they're still in there? Well, I haven't taken my eyes off it. And no one's gone in or out. Hmm. Think these are really necessary? I mean, it's not like they're expecting us. Don't underestimate these blokes. They're not messing about. Hey, we're just gonna sneak in and we sneak up. Just like that. Yeah, fair enough. But any trouble, you shoot first and ask questions later, all right? Man, I was sorely tempted to just pick up that briefcase back there and walk. Yeah, you got a lousy poker face, mate. Hey, trust me, that's nothing compared to what we're onto. Yeah, well, at my age, a bird in the hand, you know. Ew. Uh, Didn't I tell you? Oh, please. Look, I just hope you're right about this. Seems pretty quiet. Very quiet. You think they're still in there? Well, we're not gonna just barge in the front door and Looks find like out. we'll be uh, climbing up here. Well, we can't afford to waste time standing here. I think it is. I'll find a way in and check it out. You three stay here. It looks a little bit better, but <laughs> we're, uh... You were out there. Sully was running yeah. into uh, some people. <laughs> so, I don't know. noise
Oh, God. I didn't mean to. Empty? Wait a minute, where did it go? Here we go. Where the hell did they go? This doesn't make any sense. Give me a hand with this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Does anybody see a car? Because I don't see a car. I don't understand. Nobody. Damn it. Are you sure this is the right one? Yes, the green door, I'm sure. Nate, we are losing time here. And that damn briefcase is looking better and better. All right, come on. They didn't just vanish into thin air, right? There's got to be an explanation. Just spread out and look around. They were here, all right. I can still smell the exhaust. Tire tracks. Still wet from the rain. Looks like the car turned here. Ah. Uh, it's up on the other hey, one. Check this out. Oh, some kind of mechanism. Yeah, maybe. Four tires, four points of contact. Sully, stand right there. You two, like there and there. They're lucky there's four of them. All right, everybody, on three. Ready? One, two, three. And? Well, this has got to be it. Wait, it's the light. Sully, aim your beam at the wall. Like headlights. Aha! Well, I have a goddamn cadaver. <laughs> um... Nate, just who are we dealing with here? Uh, there's only one way to find out. We'll track the car. You head back to the van. We'll try and stay in radio contact. I'll let you know when we get through to the other side, all right? <laughs> Wherever the hell that is. Just be ready for anything. Might be a quick exit. No doubt. She's the best driver in the business, you know. So I've heard. Well, I think we agree this is more than a little weird. Who the hell drives their car underground? Oh, well, let me think. Someone who doesn't want to be followed, you know, it's just a guess. Smart ass. Looks Secret like they poured game. straight into the old service tunnels. Ah. Bones. It's a dead end. Well, then we'll just have to find a way around. Uh Hey, over here. Like this? Not for long. Come on. We should be able to squeeze through here. I think. Lead on, Macduff. What? Lay on. It's lay on, Macduff. Ah. <sighs> 